Guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we will be talking about factoring difference of two squares. Last video we talked about factoring common monomial. If you haven't watched that video, I'll leave the a link below this uh, video as well. So you will you will be able to check it out. Before we get started, please like, share, and subscribe. Let's get started. So guys, factoring difference of two squares. Why it is called difference of two squares? In the process, I will explain to you why it is called. Let's get with the examples right away. So number one is x squared minus 64. The first and the simplest and the common thing you have to do is first you have to get the square root of each um, one of them. So for x squared, the square root of x would be x. So how to write this one? You just have to write two parentheses and then put in x and here another x. And the square root of 64 is 8. So you just have to put 8 and 8. Since it is negative, the first one, the, the sign for this one is different. So it would be positive and negative because um, as what you have learned on your previous math classes positive times negative is always negative so since it is negative it would indicate that we have difference difference in the sign so it would be x plus 8 and x minus 8 that's why it is called difference of two squares because we have different um, sign positive and negative so this would be your factor then the next example is 25 x squared minus 4 so again um, if it is possible to get a square root you have to get the square root for each one so the square again uh, the first thing you have to do again is put in two parentheses the square root of 25 is 5 so put in 5 then the square root of x squared is x so put in x the square root of 4 is 2 so place in 2 and then again since this is negative sign you have to put in Two different sign in each of the parentheses so plus and minus so that's your answer 